It's the NBA on 2K Sports. We'll see Los Angeles taking on Salt Lake City. Salt Lake City off the tip. Here are the starters for Los Angeles. They've got Abdul Jabbar. Russell Westbrook out there with Tracy McGrady. And it's LeBron James. And it's Weber in the four slot. He always knows where his teammate's going to be in. Kevin, that will let him put the ball where he wants it, right waiting for him. And you know what? You allow a guy to get right to the rim like that, that's your only option. Yeah, exactly. I mean, free throws are always better than a layup, so I'd agree with you there, Greg. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. Just solid. Really, one of the very best there is at the free throw line. Logged in the pass to Yao. It's stolen by Abdul Jabbar. Here's McGrady. Rebound by Salt Lake City. Usually if he gets to the rim, he's converting it into points. But the defense stood tall there. And Pierce, here we go. Oh, and he plucks it off the glass. Wow. Here's Westbrook. A tad short, but it's good off the front iron. It is so hard to contain him. He just seems to get it done however he has to do it. Johnson kicks to Yao. The wide open look here for Marion. And once again off the mark by Salt Lake City. And there's Tracy McGrady, the assist by Abdul Jabbar. Here's Salt Lake City. Four point game. Here's Marion. No good that time. Good D by Weber. Salt Lake City on D. Here's Abdul Jabbar. And Kareem throws it down. Oh boy, oh boy, to be young again. <laughs> Makes you nostalgic, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah, it does make me look back a little bit, but I could never throw it down like that. It sure does look good. There's a chance he could have a big game if they don't DM up more tightly on the perimeter. And Clark, I felt like that was a one-time mistake. They've got to know to pay more attention to him than that. Here's Marion after Kareem Abdul-Jabbar score. The kick out to Pierce. Marion outside. He dishes it to Johnson. The lead pass was put in just the right spot. The heads-up aggressive play right there. Saw the smaller man on him and took it straight to the basket. Westbrook against Johnson. Here's Weber. Goes up and lays it nice and easy. <laughs> well, Merry Christmas. I mean, that was a freebie. We call that a high percentage shot, and when he's the guy taking it, I'd even say it's automatic. Here's Pierce. Again, Salt Lake City. About three minutes gone here in the first quarter. McGrady dishes to LeBron. Took him no time at all on that one. So Salt Lake City calls timeout. They're first. Yeah, maybe a change of the game plan right now, looking at some different sets because of the matchups. Yeah, I agree with you because they're looking to tweak things to maybe get those matchups working in their favor. A lot of new faces out there now for Salt Lake City. Smith with a wide open look. His three pointers off the mark. Here's Hardaway. 
Out to Wade. That drops and it comes off the assist from Hardaway. Excellent ball movement there, guys. And that's keyed this run. Passing it with purpose. The D hasn't been able to keep up. Now here's Hayward. Oh! Man. And he goes strong with the one-handed jam. And I gotta say, sort of surprising he goes for a slam that difficult when they're trailing. Mm -hmm, but, but still, a magnificent move to the rim. I don't care what the score is there, fellas. That's the play we'll remember from this game, clearly. Here's McAdoo. Again, Salt Lake City. And it looks like he might just be on his A game today, Clark. Well, you know, it's still early, partner, but that's what we're seeing so far, and we know what he can do on one of his better days. He's hard to handle. Walton, the pass to Wade. Pass break, Salt Lake City. Here's Hayward, and he uses the glass on the layup. And that's how you do it, guys. Ball pressure and then get some runouts. Hardaway kicks to Walton. It doesn't go for him. Now Salt Lake City takes it the other way. Here's Thompson. And he banks in the layup. And they are attacking the rim and getting great results. And how? I mean, they're taking this defense to task, taking them to school. Every one of their last 10 points have come in the paint. And that is a major league flush right there, my friends. And in a tight contest like this, Greg, that might be just what they need to get the tide rolling in their direction. You're exactly right. I mean, so often when a team gets that kind of explosive play out of its backcourt, that can really rally and galvanize the whole squad. The shot's good. McAdoo's got six points. Well, if you like offense, the first quarter all wrapped up, and it's been an exciting game so far. Los Angeles on top. They're up by two. And we'll be back shortly for the start of the second quarter. And we got a close game here as we get back to the second quarter. And guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown so far for Los Angeles. With the aggression they're showing early on, I mean, they're driving it to the hoop with authority and force. And the other thing, though, is their execution in terms of their ball movement has been flawless. Sets up a lot of easy scoring opportunities. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade as the second quarter gets going. Taking a look at Los Angeles. We've got Worthy. Abdul-Jabbar is out there with Rodman. Then there's Allen. And it's Westbrook in a point guard. For three, Smith. The basket good off the assist from Hayward. That shot becomes effortless for him when the D is so relaxed. They've got to get more intense. It's stolen by Smith. Chris passed to Smith. Down low. Here's Yao. That misses off the backboard. The drive by Worthy. And finished off by Worthy. Oh, and he went for the two-hander on the slam using some muscle. Some urgency from him there. Sure. I get the feeling, guys, that he may be sensing that this is a critical time in this game. Of all the guys you want to leave open out on the perimeter, he is the absolute last guy on the list. Attention to detail. Know your personnel. And his eyes got wide once he got the ball inside. You just know what he's going to do with the basketball. Rodman with the block. Worthy kicks to Rodman. And Tennis Rodman with the slam. This has been a thriller. You cannot say enough about the way these two teams have competed. All indications, Greg, are that this game is going down to the wire. I mean, I'd be surprised, actually shocked, if it ended any other way. And he's an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. He is, and he picks the simple one-hand stuff to get the two points. Hey, guys, I know I'm stating the obvious here, but those could be an important two points considering how close this game is. 
No one near Westbrook as he lets it go. And a miss there on the triple. Kicks to Yao. The feet to Smart. It's deflected. Rodman brings the double team. Just five to shoot. To the paint. Here's Yao. And no good that time. Rodman with the defensive effort. Allen shot is off. Salt Lake City trails by four. Smith dishes to Hayward. Back to Smith. Three-pointer. Good on the three-point shot. Timeout, timeout. Smith's got nine. That's far too good a look to give them from behind the arc. Three of their last five makes come from beyond the arc. The defense has to react quickly. And it's a completely new group for Los Angeles. Smith's gone three of five from deep, shooting 60% so far from way outside. Here's Love. Got a hand on it. Something that's kept this game close is the fact that the rebound stats for both teams are almost identical. The battle to a standstill on the boards has really been something to watch. And the game's not over yet. We'll see if one of these teams maintains more energy than the other going down the stretch. Here's LeBron following the score by Salt Lake City. And LeBron throws it down. Guys, seven times the lead has changed hands here now. Yeah, and that number should easily top double figures before it's over. And in terms of size, not your typical center, but man, he plays as big as any of them thanks to that terrific leaping ability. Sean Marion grabs the miss. And, and you know, you can see in his eyes, he knows that is not a dunk he should have missed. LeBron again, Pierce. And a big pounce off the rim, but it sinks right in. Pierce has got his second bucket of the game to go. You know, it wouldn't be a bad idea to put an extra body on him, get some help when he barrels his way in close. He's such a good finisher. He needs more than one guy to defend him. Here's McAdoo following the basket by LeBron James. And Marion gets it to go. Took advantage of some shoddy defense there. They've got to at least get a finger on him. Here's Love. And Love throws it down. D-Way with an excellent pass there. Out to the wing. McAdoo inside. Good D by Love. Welcome back, everyone. The second half about to get underway, and it's been a close one so far. We've got Brogdon. Pierce is out there with Marion. Then there's Yao. And it's Johnson in at the point guard position. That's Steve Kerr's five as we get into the second half. And not even three quarters out of the way. So many lead changes. The fans, guys, are getting their money's worth. Heck, I should have paid to watch this one. It's been a nail bite. It's Pierce on the wing. Back to Johnson. Salt Lake City moving the ball around. Open shot by Marion. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Most of the time, that shot will go down. Boy, the defenders have to make sure they tag it. James. Yao with the block. And here we go. Fast break. James has got it. That one goes. Count it. Abdul Jabbar's got four points in the quarter. Oh, no. He may have gotten injured right there. He's in a lot of pain. Oh, man. You just hate to see something like that. Yeah, you sure do. It's always a tough part of the game, Greg, and I really hope it's not a serious injury. And Salt Lake City making a change here. Warriors checked in. Here we go, one-on-one. -on -one. And that one's good. McGrady. 
and, and really keeping the ball hopping around here offensively. The last five trips they've had have ended with a great pass leading to a basket. They're really sharing the sugar. Great way to start to have easy layup against some soft D. Yeah, I think some of the players, Greg, quite honestly, are, are heavy legs. I mean, they don't seem to have been warmed up effectively here to start the second half. Fantastic ball movement. They're picking them apart with their passing. Purposeful passing it is, partner. Their last 10 points have all come off assists. Here's Abdul Jabbar and the dunk by Abdul Jabbar. Oh boy, oh boy, to be young again. <laughs> Makes you nostalgia, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah, it does make me look back a little bit, but I could never throw it down like that. But it sure does look good. And that one's good. McGrady. And this has been a great job of just getting into the middle of that defense and really scoring effectively from the paint. Yeah, enough scoring on the inside there. I think it's time for him to send a message to his team. Yeah, you're exactly right. I guarantee you this talk centers around cutting down on all of those points coming in the paint. They've got to show more resistance there. Looking at who's out there now for Salt Lake City. Chris, he's checked in for Marion. Hayward comes in for Ori. And Smart subbed in for Johnson. And Los Angeles will go for a different look here. Walton's checked in for Abdul-Jabbar. Odman comes in for Weber. Pierce is checked in for James. And Allen subbed in for Russell Westbrook. Salt Lake City shooting their initial free throws of the game right here. Good on both. Boy, I tell you what, he does not look like your typical big man up there at the line. He has an excellent stroke and a percentage to match. Logged in the pass to Smart. And out of bounds as Los Angeles gains possession. And, and you know what? His mind's playing tricks on him right now because he's not going to live that one down easily. Los Angeles leading by five. Now the pass to Walton to the inside and then Rodman with the dunk oh he just punches that one down with a fury and he rubs it in a little deeper with the hanging finish guys they're not backing off at all are they and that one's good Brogdon and you're asking for more trouble than you can handle if you're gonna let him just roam free from beyond the arc McGrady kicks to Walton. They get a hand on it. Stolen by Smart. We've gone about three and a half minutes into the third now. Yao dishes to Smart. Shot clock at six. Salt Lake City needs to get off a shot. So he gets the whistle, contact on the way up, and two shots coming up. Wow, wow, he got whacked on that one. Shouldn't be much debate there. Blatant contact, straightforward call, simple. And Salt Lake City with some changes. McAdoo is checked in for Chris. Thompson comes in, and Smith subbed in for Smart. And then for Los Angeles, Kevin Love's checked in for Rodman. Wade comes in for Allen. Hardaway is subbed in for Tracy McGrady. Oh, and he went for the two-hander on the slam using some muscle. Some urgency from him there, sure. I get the feeling, guys, that he may be sensing that this is a critical time in this game. Here's Hardaway for three. Pierce, no good that time. Hayward with some nice D. They time it right, they can end this quarter with a two for one. And that's how you want to end the quarters. McAdoo. Guys, he's one of the main reasons this game is tied up. I mean, he's done his part to keep them in it. Pierce kicks to Hardaway. And Kevin Love, the bucket with the assist from Hardaway. And that's now six points for Love. Three second difference between shot clock and game clock. Yao up top. For three, Smith. Rebounded by Hardaway. 
Wade right. outside. Kicks it out to Love. Hardaway passes to Walton. A beautiful reverse layup. And it's a four-point Los Angeles lead. Oh, how pretty was that? Use the rim to protect the ball. The points coming in bunches as we wrap up the third quarter. It's been a good one. Los Angeles leads by four. And we'll have the start of the fourth quarter for you as soon as we get back from this short break. Thanks for joining us again as we get set for the fourth quarter. A terrific game so far. Taking a look at Los Angeles. Weber is out there with LeBron James. Then there's Dwayne Wade. Then it's Tracy McGrady. And it's Love in at the center position. And they'll be counting on even more points from him. That's essential if they're going to pull this game out. Absolutely. No. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I love that. Yes, indeedy. Oh, he got fancy with that one. Yeah, maybe trying to give them the momentum boost they need to break this game open. And I like it, Kevin and Greg. I mean, some coaches might want to see just a sure-handed lay in there. But for me, I don't mind a little extra. Out to Thompson. Pass to McAdoo. Salt Lake City moving the ball around to take the lead. And it's out of bounds. Out of bounds. Last touch by Thompson. And that's just carelessness there. I mean, you have got to have your head in the game. And Los Angeles with some changes. Abdul Jabbar's checked in for love. And it's Russell Westbrook in for Dwayne Wade. Abdul Jabbar in the post. He's against McAdoo. Pass to Brogdon. Thompson against McGrady. Here's Brogdon. That's in. Coming off the assist from Thompson. Thompson's got three assists in the game. Westbrook again. Johnson. And the dunk by Abdul Jabbar. And I'm sensing something special going on here tonight. It certainly does have the feeling of a classic, Greg. Let's see which team is better equipped to handle the pressure. Marion dishes to McAdoo. And he makes it look easy, dunking it hard with one hand. Oh, going high to throw that one down. Sky high, fantastic one-hand jam. Boy, a nice way to punctuate that possession. Drives the hook. That one rolling around and rims out. Salt Lake City leading by three. Inside. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. You know, he has been ever-present in the paint today, guys. He's getting a lot of his points from in close. And the basket is good. Got it to go through on the contact. So a free throw coming up. A great opportunity for a three-point play. And Salt Lake City making a change here. Chris has checked in. And, guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for Salt Lake City. Boy, guys, I really like how they've driven the ball to the basket in this game. I mean, they've been very aggressive with it. And the other thing they've done since the beginning of this game is score points off turnovers and in bunches. And here is Los Angeles now. And Westbrook gets it to go. It's as if the defenses have just given up. Yeah, you know, the pace has only picked up the deeper we've gotten into this game, which is remarkable. It speaks to the endurance and stamina of these teams, and it's also been a lot of fun to watch. Chalk up two there. And Salt Lake City leads by two. Yeah, beautiful play on the interior. They're just using the height advantage to lay the ball up and in when they really needed that basket. Big time basket there on the inside. I mean, he had to get that one up and over the big guy. Way up and over the big guy. And what a time in the ball game to make it happen. And the foul called on Russell Westbrook. That's his first foul. And really, these are some of the toughest calls an official has to make. Yeah, but in this case, I think he got it right. I mean, the defender was still moving there and never really had good legal guarding position. He wasn't set. 
And so it looks like Salt Lake City will retain possession here. Fourth quarter of play and over three and a half minutes have gone by. Johnson kicks to McAdoo. Down to five on the shot clock. And he converts the layup. McAdoo's got 24 points. Unbelievable basket. I mean, giving up a lot of height there, but he was not to be denied. Not when the game's hanging in the balance. That makes it a little different. He was going to get to the rim no matter who was standing in the way on that one. Here's Chris, covered by LeBron. That was massive. You know it. He's stepping right into the spot there. And Westbrook, here we go. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. Gets the first, and that narrows the lead down to just three. Weber hits them both. And you really can't say enough about his composure in the big moments, as cool as they come. And I think we'll see them burn the clock a bit here. Yeah, smart move. Marion passes to McAdoo. Unable to get that one. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. Weber dishes to LeBron. Money! Boy, is it tough to stop LeBron right now. What a big possession right here. No doubt about it, guys. The tension is palpable. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. McGrady kicks to James. And it's Abdul-Jabbar penetrating. Missed! And the Who's foul ball? called on Russell Who's Westbrook. Ball? That's foul number two for him. Salt Lake City calls timeout. Seconds left to play here in the fourth. Marianas green on Abdul Jabbar. McAdoo inside. Regulation is ended and we're heading to overtime. We've got more NBA basketball coming your way in just a minute. Well, if you're just joining us, this one has been a great one. We've got overtime action now, folks. It's going to be Salt Lake City off the tip. And always a good ride in these post-regulation battles. This overtime now looking to be an exciting one. All fueled up and ready to go to overtime basketball here. Brought to us by Gatorade. Let's check out who's on the floor. Taking a look at Los Angeles. Hardaway is out there with Dwayne Wade. Then it's Kareem. Then it's Walton. And it's LeBron in the three slot. A chance here to get a quick injury report. Well, guys, I had a minute to catch up with Salt Lake City's head athletic trainer. And the news is pretty good. It does not look like a severe injury. Coming back tonight is not an option for him, and they are hoping he won't have to miss too much time. Back to you, Kevin. All right, David and folks, we will, of course, keep everyone updated as we find out more. And you know what? He could have a long road ahead in terms of getting back on the court. But one thing we all know, he's never been shy of hard work. No, he's not. I mean, he'll be doing everything he can to make it back as soon as possible. Hayward kicks to Mary. Four on the clock. Passes it to Thompson. That's short off the rim. Los Angeles leading by four. Yeah, way to get there first and be willing to absorb the contact. No question about it. No flop there. That was a direct shot to the chest. Brockton, he's checked in for Salt Lake City. Johnson comes in for Smith. Weber, he's checked in for Los Angeles. Westbrook comes in for Hardaway. And there's the pass to Brogdon. Out to Thompson. It's stolen by Wade. Pushing it up. In the corner, it's James. Out of bounds, Salt Lake City takes possession. 
got sloppy in a close game. You have to take advantage of every opportunity. Salt Lake City trails by four. Johnson down low. He's covered by Westbrook. Here's Yao. And finished off by Yao. Oh, going high to throw that one down. Sky high. Fantastic one-hand jam. Boy, nice way to punctuate that possession. Johnson, the pass to Marion. And Sean Marion with the slam. Oh, man, what a turnaround. Sensational play on D and then the rapid-fire run to the basket. Craig, they didn't wait around, did they? They went right for the throat. Guys, this is crunch time now. When you've got a chance to capitalize on the turnover, you've got to take it and make it. Oh, and he went for the two-hander on the slam using some muscle. Some urgency from him there. Sure. I get the feeling, guys, that he may be sensing that this is a critical time in this game. And they had a foul to give, but you want to use it on the ground. Yeah, I agree with you there, but at least they did get the clock stopped. That is the one saving grace of that situation. McAdoo is checked in for Salt Lake City. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. McGrady's checked in. And pushing it up, here's Los Angeles. James with the ball. Easy to see who's going to win that race. Yeah, early offense is often easy offense. Excellent work that time. Here's Johnson. Can't hit that one. Westbrook with the nice D there. Weber dishes to LeBron. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. Johnson in the corner. The three won't fall. And now we've got the intentional foul. Honestly, just doing what they have to in order to get the basketball back. That's a good foul, though. I like that. I mean, clock management crucial at this time of the game. So he gets them both in a, a three-point game. Absolutely massive free throws. That'll force them into a three-point attempt. Salt Lake City calls timeout. They're down by three. 12 seconds left in the first overtime. Action has been terrific. Guys, what do you think? And you know what? You've got a couple options here. You can take the three to tie it or get the quick two and then a foul. And you know, if it opens up for them inside, the quick two would be the way I would lean, Greg. But the foul has to come immediately after that. Smith for three. Right between the eyes. A tremendous three to tie it up. Los Angeles calls timeout. Another tie, and we're going to have a second overtime. And we'll be back with you right after this. And folks, we couldn't decide a winner in regulation, and we're getting set for the jump ball to start overtime. Salt Lake City with the ball. Marion kicks to Smith. Back to Marion. That one a tad offline to the right, but drops in for him. And good passing, setting up a lot of these buckets right now, Kevin. That's been the key. Dime dropping delights is what I call it. I, that is a nice pass. I will give you that one. Yeah, he was on the money, that's no doubt. Pass to Chris. This one for three. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Boy, even though he missed, you can't give up that kind of a look very often. The better to be lucky than good sometimes. Fortunately, they didn't get burned on that one. Well, check out that assist. That's a pair of teammates that are clearly on the same page. Yes, and the foul. That's on LeBron James. And how about the execution, really, when it matters most? He knew he had the height advantage and just got the job done. No need to pass in that situation. 
Magic Johnson, who checked in for Chris. Abdul Jabbar's checked in for Los Angeles. I love the low post attack on that one. Johnson outside. The jump hook. And Westbrook pulls it down. That's an unusual, surprising miss for him. Typically, he's good on those inside. James wide open. Again, Los Angeles. The, the mid-range jumper is a high percentage shot for him. And when he's got that much room, forget about it. Johnson. It's rebounded by Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Abdul-Jabbar's got nine. Oh, oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. My goodness. Oh, he got fancy with that one. Yeah, maybe trying to give them the momentum boost they need to break this game open. And I like it, Kevin and Greg. I mean, some coaches might want to see just a sure-handed lay in there, but for me, I don't mind a little extra. Johnson with it. Now McGrady defending. It's stolen by McGrady. Here's Weber. And Weber throws it down. And you've got to wonder just how big those points are going to be. A swing like that can decide a game. And I wouldn't be surprised if it does. The steal there as gutsy a play defensively as you're going to see. Check out the game for Johnson. He has eight points and four assists. Good on the first, and that shrinks the margin to just four. Richardson, he's checked in for Salt Lake City. And so he hits both. And now down to a one-possession game. Those foul shots, huge. Here's McGrady. Yes! Not phased at all by having a bigger defender on him down low, and I really thought he would be. You know, at first glance, you wouldn't think that he'd be comfortable in that particular situation, but boy, I tell you what, he didn't look like he was out of his element at all right there. Gordon Hayward's checked in for Richardson. Salt Lake City trailing by five. Johnson, the best Dial. It's stolen by Abdul Jabbar. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Here's McGrady. Abdul Jabbar tipped away. Gotta score quickly. Yeah, no time to waste here, partner. Here's Brogdon. Count it. And he has brought them to within two points. The D just sagged off just enough and no hesitation on his part. He drops the first one, and that makes it a three-point lead. Second one is good. Getting both at the line, and it's a four-point ball game. Two-possession game now, guys. Some very important free throws there. Salt Lake City calls timeout. They're trailing by four. 23 seconds left in the second overtime period, and here we are. And Salt Lake City making a change here. Smith has checked in. Pass to Brogdon. From downtown. First free throw is good, and that narrows the lead down to just three. Smith hits them both. And they're going to prolong the game here with an intentional foul. No choice but to foul there, but, it, but he's probably the last guy you want to see on the line. But there was no time really to be selective. Stopping the clock was the priority. And so he drops them both. It's a four-point ball game. And, and that's curtains for him. Some really good work at the charity strike to close this one out. And the whistle blows, and it's going to be an over-the-back call here. Yeah, no doubt about that one with the over-the-back call. 
Yeah, it looked like he wanted to take him for a ride right there. Easy call. Here's Smith. On its way from Hayward for two. Here's Brogdon. Off target with that shot. And so Los Angeles 